Alrighty, well, morning everybody, and once again, it's cast time. Um, and this is gonna be my second attempt. Uh, my first attempt, it didn't even get a, didn't even get off the ground. I think it lasted maybe about, about a minute or so. I made the mistake of, uh, wanting to play some funk music. It's the, um, it was like this really rare album that wasn't copyrighted. So, as a kind of celebration, I thought I'd go ahead and play that. Didn't work. Like I said, it was too distracting. I couldn't think straight. I couldn't, like, the... Like the music was too funky or something, I don't know, but it, like like I said, it just it was hard to concentrate. So this this here is kind of an emergency, kind of an emergency album here. Um, it's it's from um, I played this kind of music before. It's from a channel called Iron Cthulhu Apolo Iron Cthulhu Apocalypse. It seems I'm having trouble with English. Um, anyway, it's gonna be Cursed Soundtrack. The Disanomicon? The Disanomicon? I guess that's how it's pronounced. So, but like I said, it, this was this wasn't my first choice. So, and uh, and I'm hoping to cut. I'm hoping to keep this short because I gotta get this uploaded before midnight. Uh, cause it's it's Monday, so I'm anticipating them uh doing their or my uh, my ISP Charter Spectrum doing their planned maintenance where they're going to shut down my internet for at least an hour. So, I want to get this uh, all uploaded and everything before then. So, let me go ahead and rewind that. Okay, but um, otherwise, fairly busy day today. Um, I just started the day off like I usually do. Uh, with a stream and like yesterday I decided not to do a pinball stream instead doing a killer instinct one instead so and uh but like yesterday I just did um I mostly did random battles with random characters um and uh I did I did however uh, nor I was gonna I was gonna act I actually did have the game all up and running and everything so I could I could show you the character but uh, like I said I'm trying to I'm trying to get all this done before midnight so that leaves me about an hour so what I'm gonna go ahead and do instead is oops here let me fix that um his name's Gargos I had a I actually kind of took a liking to this character to the due to the way he plays um you don't, you don't have to be an expert with this or, hey, that's clickable. Um, I hope you can escape out of this. Okay. But yeah, he's, um, he's a kind of character that can do a little bit of everything. And at least in my opinion, he actually does some things better than some of the other characters I've played. Um, I find him to kind of be a, kind of be a better grappler than Cheap Thunder. He's supposed to be like, he's supposed to work like Zangief in Street Fighter, but when I played him, eh. Um, but I, I found he, he's got, he's got, a, he's got a command grab, and I don't know if Chief Thunder has this, but, uh, he can even... He even had his his throw, his command throw is even in the anti-air. It could snatch uh, it could snatch jumping opponents right out of the air and grab them. So I don't, well, I, hell, I don't even think um, Zangief or any other grappler that I can think of, none of their none of their grabs work uh, work on airborne opponents, but this guy's does. So so in my opinion, he's he's a grappler. I mean, but kind of like a lot of other grapplers in all the other games, it's like he has one more throw than everybody else. That's it. So, but that aside, I I can actually get better use out of this than I could out of uh, cheap thunder throws. And on top of that, oh, Devil's Divide, it grabs him and punt. You can punch or kick him three times. Then after that, 
you can finish them off. Um, you can move in one of four directions and then it, four different options right here. And um, another thing that he can do, I can go up here a little bit. So he's a little bit like Jacko as well. Um, Jacko from Guilty Gear. He can uh, summon minions. Uh, he's kind of like the summoner in Final Fantasy XIV. Same thing. So he can summon a minion. And then um, he can even grab those minions and do do various things to them. Huh? Yeah. Um, and you can do uh, different effects when you grab a minion as well. So, like I said, he can do a little of everything. And then, it actually says here. And once again, the reason I'm using this Yeah, I guess you guys can kind of read it. I'll tell you what, I'll just go ahead and full screen this. Um, but... But he's also... Yeah, there's this. He could jump up to he could jump in the air up to four times, so he's got some damn good air mobility. He's good at zoning. Um probably better than uh Glacius, because um all of his zoning attacks are centered on your opponent. Whereas uh I think Glacius is zoning their uh their his stuff goes off in absolute directions, like like a little bit in front of him. Uh, half a screen in front, full screen, that kind of thing. They're all, they're all, they're all three different locations, short, medium, and long, and that's it. Whereas, uh, all of his zoning attacks are centered around the opponent, like underneath the opponent, in front of the opponent, on top of the opponent, that kind of thing. And it says it here too. He can, he's also a good grappler, and at least in my opinion, um, he. He actually does it better than Thunder. Now, to be fair, I haven't played Chief Thunder that much. But from what I played at him, it is... Uh, he has, uh, he can do... I can, you think he can do an extra thing or two with his main throw. I think he has a command throw as well. And then same thing here, he can, uh... Just, like I said, just like Jackal. He can summon minions. Which, just don't surprise me here. And yeah, he's a big old boy, so he's got a big hurt box, he's a big target. But like I said, um, he's this is a guy I'm definitely taking interest in. Um, he can he can do a little bit of everything, and at least in my opinion, he does some things better than uh, some things better than others. Um, but um, if I do stream Killer Instinct tomorrow, I'll probably do the same pattern. Just um, I'll just pick random characters, and um. Yeah, fighting random battles with random characters. Yeah, that's it. I think mine's kind of wandering off. But um, also at this conjecture too, um, there's gonna be a chance that pinball might be being put on the back burner. Um, tomorrow is gonna be a new week, a new matchup week. So I, it's it's debating right now, but I might just uh, stream long enough long enough just to do that just do the uh the new weekly matchup tables and that's it but uh we'll we'll see come tomorrow so and then gems of war um this time around i just played it for like five ten minutes um just did a few pvp battles and that was it so 
Um, and then, um, there was something else I was wanting to say about Killer Instinct. Oh, yeah, I, um, I actually put up a tutorial video. It was, um, it's meant for, it's meant for people that check out my Final Fantasy XIV blog. Because I'm guessing a lot of them have never played the game before, so I thought I'd go ahead and make a vid just to give those people an idea as to what I'm talking about. I think I did the same thing for Gems of War as well. You know, so I'm not leaving them in the dark. Because um, the way it's looking right now, if I do um, play Killer Instinct more, I'll probably be talking about it more on my blog post. So, probably going to use some technical terms and stuff like that. So, like I said, I don't want to... I don't want to leave anybody in the dark. So that's why I put out that tutorial video. If I can remember to, I'll go ahead and uh, post that tutorial video in my uh, description. In my description. So. Um, and then, and then one more thing I did is uh, I went ahead and shelled out the forty dollars to pre-order uh, Capcom Fighting Collection. It comes out on Steam next week, uh, next Friday, I believe. I'm kind of looking forward to that because uh, it's got a, it's got Super Puzzle Fighter Turbo. It was a, it was a game that I played the living hell out of back in the '90s. So, really awesome game. Um, and then it's also got a, it's got a game called Red Earth. Or iced earth or something like that. I can't remember the exact name, but it was a uh, supposed to be a pretty popular yet obscure game back in the day. Um, it's got Dark Stalkers. I played that back in the nineties. Um, didn't didn't really care much for it, but it's also got uh, Vampire Saviors. It's also got uh, Dark Stalkers Three. Oh, Vampire Savior is like Dark Stalkers Two or something like that. But it's got those games in there. Um, I think it's got uh, Super Street Fighter 2 Turbo. I think that's in there. I'm trying to think what else is in there. I can't really think of any. But yeah, the, the main reason... So, at least with me... Forty dollars to be able to play um, Super Puzzle Fighter, definitely worth it. And um, so what what that means too is uh, even then, I may not be streaming Killer Instinct for that long either. Cause um, as early as next Saturday, I'm definitely gonna be playing uh, Capcom Fighting Collection. I'm gonna I'm gonna take a drink of some Arizona green tea. Hold on. Um, oh, and I do need to mention, um, this coming Saturday, most likely there's not going to be a stream. Um, I got family stuff I have to attend to. So, uh, just, big old, big old birthday party I got to go to, so. I'm trying to think. I thought there was something else I was wanting to say, too. Um, oh, in, in case I didn't say a few moments ago, yeah, um, okay, I did, I did, yeah. Even that I won't be, uh, streaming Killer Instinct that long. As early as next Saturday, it'll be Capcom Fighting Collection. But, uh, like I said, it dropped, it comes out on Steam on Friday, but it'll be in, it'll, it'll be in my work week, so I probably, most likely won't be streaming it then. Or let me rephrase that. There's gonna be a chance that I won't be on. It's it's during my work week, so I'm very tentative on whether or not I actually stream on those days. I have to really be up for it in order for me to do it. So so if not on Friday or Saturday, then probably on Sunday, I'll definitely be streaming it then. So uh, but. 
otherwise, that's gonna do it. Um, but yeah, I think I've, I think I've said all the things that I wanted to say this morning, so I gotta get going and, um, get this thing all uploaded and stuff like that. Um, again, I'm anticipating that, um, I'm anticipating that Charter Spectrum is gonna be shutting down my internet to do their, um, to do their planned maintenance, so... Otherwise, hey, thanks for uh, tuning in and listening to me, everybody. I appreciate that. Always do. And um, I should be able to do another one of these tomorrow. So, but until then, I'll see you all next time. Bye for now.